Holy crap, what a week, right? I don't know if you guys saw my previous video. If not, I'll put a link right up here. I'm doing a custom Glock giveaway for a Polymer 80 full build. It won't be just like this, but it will be a gray frame. Working on the slide, getting all the parts for that. If you haven't seen that, link will be up here, and that's why you guys have been seeing my videos being re-uploaded. Channel was hacked, 20 videos were deleted. We're gonna dive up close here in a minute, take a look at it, talk about how it runs, you know, at the range, stuff like that. What's really interesting about this is it looks like an animal. You know, Norso, if you didn't see my review I did on their slides before, I'll put a link up here as well for that. They got some really affordable custom Glock slides. One of the things about Norso that a lot of other companies don't do is they actually manufacture their own slides, can make the slide, and then cut it and ship it to you. That way you don't have to go through the trouble of sending your slide in if you don't want to. I'll also have a 5% off coupon code down in the description below for you guys. That way, if this is something that you wanna get, you can get 5% off of it. But I urge you to go check out their website. I'll put their link below because they got a ton of different stuff. Now, Norso, I've been working with them since about a year now, since August of last year, they sent me out some stuff back when nobody would send me slides or anything to review because I had so few YouTube subscribers. So they were one of the people that just took a chance with me and sent me some stuff for review. So I am a little bit biased towards them. So keep that in mind, guys. But either way, they do some amazing work on this reptile here. Um, this one I had done for the Gen 4 because I have a ton of Gen 3 slides. I wanted something for my Gen 4. This was the very first Glock that I ever bought, you know, minus the slide. This is a one of my favorite uh, EDC setups right here. The one thing I love about Norso more than I do for the other slide companies that are out there is Norso is not afraid to try something different. If you go look at their slide packages, they don't look like anything you've seen from other companies. Norso, they take it a step further. They got one that looks like the window ports on a submarine. They got one that looks like the skeleton of an ultralight airplane. And then they got this one that looks like a reptile. And I thought it was fitting to have the Viper on it because the Viper is a reptile. So let's dive down up close. Let's take a look at this and see if it's something that's worth your time, my time, who knows. So I've got a few different guns here that I want to show you the difference in um, as far as the finish is concerned. But let's start out with the Norso CNC reptile package. Definitely digging it. It's a sweet shooting little slide. <laughs> It tracks very flat. It's had just enough weight removed to make up for the red dot. And if you run it without a red dot, it still runs great as well and shoots pretty darn flat. One of the interesting things about this is the serrations. I mean, look at those serrations, look at this window and it looks like the scales of like a snake. Thought that it was fitting to put the Viper on here because the Viper is a snake. So kind of works out for me. Very sweet shooting little slide got the Ameriglow sights on there you can see the dot and the co-witnessing i gotta readjust the elevation on this dot but otherwise you can see it looks beautiful got the apex uh brownells exclusive trigger in there i'll put a link in the coupon code for that as well i definitely dig that right now you can pick up the vortex viper for about 179 dollars or sometimes less got the agency arms magwell a lot of people ask me questions on that but yeah so what's What's really cool about this is he offers this in a myriad of different Cerakote options, but this is the nitrided version. This one on the Polymer 80 is what's called a DLC or diamond light carbon coating, and it's very similar. It's a different process, but it's very similar. One thing you gotta think about when you're looking at these types of coatings is the friction coefficient, meaning how slippery is it? And the DLC is probably has highest coefficient of friction, meaning that it's easier to grab in a non serrated part so your hand doesn't slip. And this one is very close on its black nitrided finish. Um, it does have like a lot of nice serrations on it, but even if I grab say here, where there's no serrations here, and no serrations here, I can still pull this slide without slipping. Now this is the Grey Ghost Precision slide that is made by Aero Precision. I just did a video on this, so I'll put a link down in the description below. But this, this I love this slide. Downside is friction coefficient 
is very low, meaning it's pretty slippery, even on the knurled parts right here. It's not a deal breaker for me, but it's definitely something to consider if you're gonna purchase this. Now, in their defense, they do make another one that actually has serrations, and I did shoot that at Trigicon. And it shoots like a dream, had no problems, you know, racking the slide. Now with this one, if you use the gun the way you're supposed to, you know, using the rear serrations or pulling it from the rear, I don't have any problems. It's only when you go to press check, it starts sliding and stuff like that. But I wanted to just bring those up just so we could get some uh, comparison going with this black nitrided finish. Now what's great about it is it's tough as nails as compared to Cerakote. Cerakote will wear out over time, scratch off. This can, but it's a lot less likely to occur. Damn good job by Norso CNC. Thank you guys for sending this out and thank you for letting me keep it. I needed the new Gen 4 slide. Back up top. So what do you guys think of the reptile slide from Norso? Leave me a comment down below. A lot of people are very cautious about getting like these window ports put on their guns on the top or on the bottom because they're worried about, you know, dirt getting into the barrel and the action and stuff like that. And I'm just gonna say this, this is what I have to say, is this little portion of the slide that's cut out where your slide lock goes, that's a pretty big open spot for dirt to get in. I mean, if you look at the slide to frame fitment on a Glock, it's pretty wide, dirt's gonna get in there anyway. So I don't typically think that these windows are gonna make that big of a difference. I think if this is a route that you wanna go, I would really look into their pre-order where they get, take a slide, they cut it, they do the uh, nitriding finish and they send it to you. It's only 450 bucks, plus you'll get 5% off with my code. I think that's the best deal at the moment. Now, after the pre-order, obviously that price is gonna go up. But if you don't wanna do that, if you wanna do something like send your slide in, get it done, it's gonna be less than $400 and then it's gonna be even cheaper with our discount code. I mean, Norso, as always, delivers great quality. I don't have anything negative to say about this because it runs great. I think that it looks good. The nitride finish holds up like a champ. The nitriding is a lot tougher than Cerakote. Cerakote's just like a hardened ceramic paint that will chip and scratch over time. And this is more stand, like this is more similar to the OEM finish on your Glock than it is to Cerakote or anything else that you've seen. The serrations, they are aggressive enough to catch your hand where it doesn't slip, but they don't aggravate your hand. But yeah, I mean, that pretty much completes my review of this thing. It runs like a champ. I love it. It's beautiful. It gets a good review. So if you want more information, it'll be down in the link below. But now it's time for the PewTuber tip of the day. I've received probably about five or six different emails from guys over the past five days. Ever since my videos got deleted, a lot of people have been reaching out saying, hey, I have a channel that been, I've been doing it for a year and it's just not growing. Or I need to make more money, it's not enough. Well, I'm gonna tell you guys something about, a dirty little secret about YouTube that nobody really tells you. You're not gonna make any money from YouTube ads. Unless you're PewDiePie or you got a million subscribers, you're not gonna make much money. Let me just put this into perspective for you. Last month, I had over 250 something thousand views on my channel and I had made around $200. So obviously, I mean, yeah, I could probably get some ammo with that and I'm not ungrateful for it, but you can't make a living unless you just blow up. Here's the advice that a lot of people don't wanna hear, but a lot of people need to hear. There's only two ways that money is made. One, it's printed at the Federal Reserve, and two, you exchange a good or a service for it. Nobody's gonna pay you to, to make videos unless you're swapping services. So I always urge people, hey, go over to Amazon Associates, sign up for their affiliate account. You can do it if you have a YouTube channel or a website or both. I highly suggest getting a website. You need a .com name because there are a ton of other affiliate programs out there and you can't get approved for them without a .com email address. Wix is always the easiest one to get started. Um, I'll put a link below where you guys can pick that up if that's something you wanna do. It's real easy just to get a template and get a .com web address. And then when you wanna apply for other affiliate programs, you can be approved for them. Because otherwise, if you just use your YouTube account, you're gonna need 50,000 or more subscribers to get approved. With a website, you could have a couple thousand visitors a month and they will approve you. So website's always 
And so that's the thing, you know, I've heard a lot of people talk about, oh, I've been demonetized, I've been demonetized. It's like, well, look, you gotta get up and start working. And that is my YouTuber tip. One, if you wanna make more money, you gotta sell something or you gotta go work for someone who is selling something. Do their bullshit handiwork. That's the only way you're gonna make money. Um, nobody's gonna pay you to make videos. So thank you guys so much for subscribing. Thank you guys who have joined the Dream Glock giveaway um, to help us rebuild the channel. The main reason I'm doing this is because I lost over 80,000 views when those 20 videos were deleted. That really impacts the way that a channel will grow the next month. So you guys are killing it. Um, if you want more information, I'll put the link, like I said, down in the description below. That way you guys can enter that. I've only been doing the uh, contest now for a few days, so you're not too late to get in on it. And I will draw the winner on September 30th. But thank you guys for subscribing. I love you and you guys stay sexy.